Hello there, how's it going? My name is Lindsay. Welcome to my channel and welcome to this week's try on haul. For this week's try on video, I did pick up some items from Amazon and I don't know about you, but I find it pretty difficult to shop for clothes on Amazon unless I watch videos like this because it seems like there's just so much junk you have to sift through on there. I think I did pretty okay for this being my first time shopping without any guidance on there and I'm hoping the more I do this the better their suggestions to me will be. If you also have trouble finding things that you like on Amazon then hopefully this will be helpful. Most of the items that I picked up for today's video are dresses so I'm going to go ahead and get the few items that are not dresses out of the way first. For this first outfit, which also happens to be my favorite, I am wearing this white skirt and this V-neck orange crop top. I'm going to start off with the skirt because it is my favorite from this whole entire haul. It comes in tons of colors and it is also part of the prime try before you buy option. So if you were interested in it, you can order it without being charged on your card and then try it on yourself. And if you like it, you can keep it and pay for it. And if you don't, you can return it within seven days and you'll never receive a charge on your card. I believe you're allowed to put six items in your prime try before you buy cart. This is $29.99 but I bought it on sale for $24.99 and I got it in the size large which I am usually a medium but after looking at photos and reading some things I went with the large and I'm very glad that I did. I could have possibly gone up to an extra large even but I think that the large was well enough. It comes in sizes extra small to a double XL and it has these little built-in bike shorts shorts underneath and one of the sides has a little phone pocket right here. It is a really nice bright white and I love this so much I'm definitely keeping it. I paired that with this v-neck crop top from a brand called Vetior. V Vetior? I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, this also comes in tons of colors. I got it in a size large. It does have a tulip hem at the waistline and it comes in sizes extra small through extra large. The next item that I picked up is this short sleeve knit sweater tee. It is on the warmer side because it is a sweater tee, um, but if you are working from home through the summer or working in an office that's cold, then this would be good for that. I got it in this light green color. It comes in several other colors. It has this knit detail throughout that is see-through, so if you wanted to wear a tank top underneath, you could do that, but I think it's just fine with a nude colored bra. It has a slightly scalloped v-neckline and some ribbing down at the bottom. Like I said, this comes in a ton of other colors and it comes in sizes extra small through extra large. The last thing I picked up before we get into the dresses are these jean shorts from Signature by Levi Strauss. These are a junior's line, so I got them in a size 13 or 31. They have this floral print all over them. They are nice and stretchy. They fit me really well. They weren't too long or too short. They have a rolled cuff at the bottom and a zipper closure with the button on top. This style was called Mermaid Isle and it comes in five other colors or styles. They're only $23.08 and they come in juniors sizes 1 through 17. Now for the dresses. The first dress that I tried on is this blue and white gingham print that is going to be perfect for the 4th of July. I was actually disappointed when this came in because I saw that I accidentally ordered it in a size small and I meant to get it in a size medium. However, when I tried it on, it actually still fit perfectly fine. Um, the only gripe I had was that the arms were a little bit tight on me, but they really weren't even that bad. So I guess you could, if you're between sizes, size down in this. It does have a smocked bust and the bottom of the smocking that is supposed to be like under your bust and closer to your waistline was actually still pretty loose on me even though this is a size small. So this is really comfortable and forgiving. It has these puff shoulder sleeves that I think could be worn on or off the shoulder. It hit me at about knee length if I'm remembering correctly and it does have a slit on the left side that goes up about halfway above my thigh. This comes in five other colors and comes in sizes small through extra large. The next dress I picked up is this light sage green maxi dress. It has a smocked bust as well with these 
cuff sleeves. This one, I don't think you could wear it on the shoulder. I think it is meant to just be off the shoulder. It has a ruffle hem up above the bust and it does have this bow detail, but it is not functioning. It has the three tiers going down the skirt part of the dress. This is 100% polyester and it was really wrinkled when I got it out of the package. So I did have to steam this. It comes in four other colors, which are black, blue, purple, and pink. I got it in the size medium and it comes in sizes small through extra large. The next dress that I got is this black halter tank dress that does have a wrap detail and it ties on the side and has some like ruching on the side. So this is really flattering. However, I will say I got this in a size medium. And so if you wanted a tighter, more bodycon type fit, I would say get your true size. But if you wanted it to be a little looser and a little more comfortable and forgiving, maybe go up a size. This is pretty lightweight and comfortable. So I think it's a nice little black dress option for the summertime heat. It could be worn casually or dressed up. It's shown that this comes in a lot of not only different colors but different styles as well including some with cap sleeves some with long sleeves so you'll have plenty to choose from this was $34.99 and comes in sizes small through extra large the next dress that I picked up is this tube top style dress and I didn't realize when I bought it but this is actually intended to be a swim cover-up and that makes sense now that I'm feeling it and whenever I tried it on you could still wear it as a dress if you wanted um, but I might size up if that was what I was trying to do with it I got it in the size medium this has red white and blue in it so it would be really cute for the 4th of July it comes in lots of other colors and styles including some with straps and the sizing is a little weird it says extra large through 16 um, I grabbed this in the size 8 which the tag says medium so it's just kind of weird on the sizing. This was $16.99. The next item I picked up is this really pretty light blue romper and it has adjustable straps so you can tighten them or loosen them as you need. And it is cinched in at the waist with an elastic and it is a deeper V neckline. This comes in sizes extra small through extra large, but for each size, it also has a plus. So it comes in like, for example, extra small, and extra small plus what I, I haven't seen that before i got this in a large so maybe i should have gotten it in a large plus or an extra large because it was a little bit short for me but i do really like the color and it was still cute and it comes in a ton of other colors and prints and this was 25.99 the next dress I picked up is this yellow t-shirt dress. It does have the tulip hem down at the bottom and the ruching on the side, so it is really flattering. It is lined in the back, so it's not see-through. Now the tulip parts up front are more sheer and see-through, but they're just over your legs, so it's not that big of a deal. I thought that this was a little more interesting than your average t-shirt dress because of the buttons on the neckline. You see here, this one goes off to the side with this little piece so it kind of looks a little undone and just adds a little unexpected detail. This comes in a ton of different colors and comes in sizes small through extra large and I got it in the size medium. The final item I picked up is this white dress with the pink floral print all over it. It is on or off the shoulder whichever you choose with the ruffle hemline at the top and it does have a zipper closure in the back this is really cute but i would suggest sizing up if you wanted a little bit looser more comfortable fit i got this in a large it was really form fitting it does have these little bustier style cups but um, they don't provide any support really and it does have this keyhole here with the tie which is kind of comically long I was worried about wearing a strapless bra with this and it's showing through the keyhole, but it wasn't a problem. And I know Valentine's Day is a really long way away, but this would be really cute for that. This comes in five color options and sizes extra small through large and was $24.99. That is all that I picked up for this Amazon haul. I hope you enjoyed it and maybe found something that you are interested in. If you did, let me know down below. I'll have everything linked in the description box for easy access if you were interested in buying any of these. If you're interested in mid-size affordable fashion try-ons, I do them every Thursday. So I hope you stick around and to see you at the next one.